France takes a day out in the sun. Though its political horizon is clouded and the country is without a government, 200,000 put on their Sunday best and jam Longchamp for the race of the year. To help British racegoers, Prince Mololulu is there to let them have a cheval in a language they understand. The race everyone has come to see is the Prix de Luc de Triomphe, richest race in the world, worth 30,000 pounds. A record field of 28 gets away on the mile and a half long course. Among them are four British trained horses and eight jockeys, including derby winner Charlie Elliott. But it's a French horse that shoots into an early lead, Monsieur Boussac's Neval. <laughs> Out in the country, there's little to choose between Derby runner-up Amour Drake and Jack Hilton's Royal Empire, racing along almost neck and neck. Amour Drake leads the way into the home stretch, but suddenly out of the middle of the field comes Coronation Five. The French horse shoots to the front with ease, and Parisian jockey Roger Porcelli guides his filly home with no trouble at all, four lengths ahead. Rita Hayworth's entry, Double Rose, ridden by Bill Rickaby, is second. For Coronation's backers, there are odds of 9 to 2. For the punters who followed Prince Monolulu, there's a hitchhike home. And for Monsieur Boussac's prize, there is no government to take it away. Yeah.